something, okay? The Bake Show. All right, I like Baker Mayfield. I want to see him succeed with the Cleveland Browns. Um, you have too much invested in him to have him flop, okay? What I don't understand is why certain people have been dogging Baker Mayfield about his last two games, all right? He, they lose to the Raiders, and Baker throws for 122 in terrible weather. And then they beat the uh, Texans, and he throws for, what was it, 132, I think it was, in terrible weather. You cannot expect any quarterback to put up big numbers with that kind of win. Think about the two quarterbacks that Baker went up against the last two games. Derek Carr only threw for 112, and Deshaun Watson threw for 163. And so it's just, I'm not making excuses for Baker, but I am making excuses. When you have to play in that kind of weather, you can't be expected to throw the ball for any kind of, uh, you know, uh, big numbers. And, and the other thing is that, that there's only one number, as far as I'm concerned, that counts, especially when you get to this point of the year, and that's wins. And That's right. Uh, you, you know, people say, well, Cleveland should be used to weather. Why, why should they be used to bad weather? They, they come up here, they play, they may hit bad weather once or twice a year, and that's it. Why are they any more prepared than the visiting team coming in? And, and that and wasn't right, just like, bad weather. That was that was torrential storms. Right. And, well, certainly the 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 Vegas uh, game, the weather seemed to be worse. But both games, the wind was howling. And here's the thing: you and I have lived in this climate all our lives. But imagine, you know, playing football and saying, "Well, I'm used to windy conditions," and then go out and try to throw a football in them. It, it doesn't matter whether you're used to them or not. The ball is still going to do all kinds of crazy things uh, when the wind gets a hold of it. So that's when uh, you get deflections. That's when you get all kinds of wild things happening. Yeah, and, and here's the deal: I, I get there is some nervousness about Baker Mayfield. You know, in other words, it, when you evaluate him, is he definitely a franchise quarterback? This year has been so odd because. He hasn't been asked to throw for many yards in very many games. And when he has been asked to carry a team, uh, it hasn't gone well, meaning at Baltimore and at uh, Pittsburgh. Because against the Raiders, the Raiders' offense won that game, not the Raiders' defense. The Raiders' offense kept the ball for 38 minutes. Um, so Mayfield has not had to throw for gaudy numbers, so you haven't really seen uh, a dynamic quarterback play but I still like a lot of what Baker Mayfield brings to the table and I'm looking forward to what he has in store the remainder of the season I had a conversation